got kind of something special planned for today. All right. So this morning, actually last night, actually this weekend, I've been thinking about this mod pretty much the whole time trying to uh, figure out exactly how it's going to fit into my life. Does that make sense? We'll see how exactly it goes, uh, but I am excited to kind of get it to, uh, I don't know, get it to start out, get, get the idea of how it's going to start out or whatever. It's fun. Played a lot of Valheim over the weekend. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm interested to see how it changes the dynamic of the actual game itself. And uh, give it like a go from the start to finish kind of thing. Well, finish, you know what I mean. Um, just a full-on college try of what it's like to get to certain aspects of... I don't know, completing certain aspects of the uh, skill tree, if you will, just with having a, a, I don't know, a base that can go mobile. I like the Stardew Valley music, of course. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do more of that going forward. By the way, just background music from other games, games we play, games we like. So yeah, that's kind of the plan today. Uh, we'll do some Valheim Raft. Um, we'll see how it goes. Maybe we'll switch back over to WoW. I'm really close on my Kulturin ra uh, race unlock. But every single time I finish certain aspects of this race unlock, uh, more things come up. So... And I did a little bit of research, and it's like apparently one of the hardest ones to unlock. <laughs> That's fun. How cool is that? It's the hard, it's one of the hardest ones to unlock. I just happen I happen to need to unlock that one. I I have this desire in World of Warcraft. Not even that I plan on playing lots of World of Warcraft, but that if I were to play World of Warcraft, that I'd be a chunky boy drunken kung fu master which sounds amazing because my favorite martial arts growing up as a kid was of course Jackie Chan's drunken master so making a character that kind of resembles me uh, and then and then playing that sounds dope and then once we're done with that Is it this one? Is it this one? Is it this one? I don't think it'll work. There we go. We'll put it up on the shelf. It'll hang out up here for a while. It won't be bothered anymore. We'll, uh, you know, we'll do, we'll do that. Oh, hold on, hold on. I, I messed up a little bit here. We'll do that one more time. What are these? We'll put it up here on the shelf, uh, so it doesn't get touched ever again uh, until we're ready to. Um, and then I'll, later we'll bring it back. We'll bring it back down over to the, the table when we're ready to play some more World of Warcraft. I haven't really decided even if that's something I want to do. Or maybe I want to be a World of Warcraft streamer. I don't know. <laughs> we'll figure it out. If we do, if we don't, who knows. So yeah, that's the plan with that. Let's play some Valheim Raft. One moment, please. Just one moment.
All right, we're back. We're back, we're back, we're back. You like the voice change? If I'm tiny, I should be, I should, I should have a high pitched voice, right? I mean, it really, it kind of goes hand in hand. I don't know why I haven't been messing with the voice stuff in a while, but I just haven't been. All right, we got to start this mod through the mod manager, right? Let's uh, mod manager, game mod stuff. There we go. Vortex. Mods. Update them, deploy mods, okay. Let's turn that down and this up and get started in some Valheim. Oh, you know what? I kind of feel like this is going to need its own little intro as well. I just realized kind of a uh, uh, a little bit of a send off to the, what what the goals are here. So this, how do I do this? Am I recording? There we go. So this is Valheim. I'm just kidding. This is Valheim Raft. It's a mod that essentially uh, in early in the game gives you the ability to start building your base on an ever expanding raft. So it's not it's it's like that basic raft, but it's got the ability to build on it. You have to build your own sails and like rudders. Essentially, think of the game raft, but in Valheim. So I imagine it's going to change the dynamic of a lot of things. It's the only mod I've installed. I don't really play a lot of modded stuff. Just wanted to try out what this particular mod looked like. Am I green pants see through right now? That's kind of funny. Um. That's the plan. We're going to start there. I'm going to give it kind of a full playthrough from the very beginning up. I've seen a couple edited videos. I'd like to just see what it felt like to go through the whole process, share that with you, and we can go kind of from there and tell me what you think. You can watch live if you're watching. If you don't watch, if you're, if you're watching this on YouTube later, then uh, I do this live sometimes. Follow the channel, figure it out. I'm not your babysitter. Welcome to the channel. Okay, we're going to play some Valheim Raft. Let's get started. But what other mods did you guys install on yours? I just don't want things to conflict with particularly the mod. Give anyone any uh, uh, misguided sense of what the game offers or whatever. There we go. Got a little tweaked there. So we're going to start a whole fresh character. Um, new character. OK, that's cool. The later beards are actually a lot cooler. I mean, thick. I don't know. Sure, make them. Oh, red. I've never played with a redheaded character before.
What are we calling it? What? One that would let you place stuff on wood planks. Ah, okay. So there may be mods in the long run that do need to be. Oh gosh, it's so bright. Here. Here, hold on. Hold on. Nope. Raft characters. Maya and Ro Ru Ru Ruai. R O U H I. I just realized that's what we should be doing. We should make the Minecraft, uh, the Minecraft, the raft guys. The raft dudes. Let me pull up Raft Homie and get a look at Raft Homie's hair. Oh, okay. All right, cool. It's like dreadlocks. Oh, that's pretty good. And there's a, it's like a little, uh, it's this one. There we go. It's Raft, dude. Let me see if there's maybe a better dreads. Um, I mean, really, is it the dreads that matter or is it the fact that it's a ponytail matters more? Yeah, dreads, it's cooler looking. Braids, sorry, braids. Messy braids, tied up braids. Oh, right, and a whole new world, too. Mmm. Raft. Raftland. So when you're saying stuff on wood planks, there's things you can't place on wood planks? why they give you the dirt option the dirt floor it gives you that dirt floor stuff interesting <laughs> well we'll see oh the intro I always forget about the intro this game lets you be pretty active in all aspects Hey, Moody, how you doing this morning, homie? Except in the very beginning. You have to wait. Wait to play the game. The world, they would be born again. In Valheim. In Halvheim. It's like Hugin and Mugen, right? So is this Mugen? I think it's a Valkyrie. Interesting. I would not have put that together. Dude, seriously? Stop.
Whoa. It's really close. So I have PTSD if you mention Valkyrie. Sorry, how you doing, bro? Hey, Saxor, how you doing morning? How you doing this morning, bud? We're uh we're playing some modded modded Vigi games. Raven doesn't have white on it. Mm. We're already gonna need to find water. I think I see it already. You can please, please do not do this all day for me, bud. Oh yeah, that was a pretty long fight. It was the final, it was the final Valkyrie. It was, uh, you know, justifiably a long, egregiously long, stressful fight. Halvime. <laughs> it did. Let's do this, bud. You and me, baby. Ooh, I'm already nervous about like certain animals that you really only see in the water how that affects things when all your whole livelihood is on the raft Ugh. it wasn't so bad it took three tries yeah just three times about a hundred <laughs> let's craft that I made sure this was working last night, by the way. That would be rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We build a portal from the boat to our main base. We still do smelting at the base since it, since we make the boat that ugly. Oh. Two stone, okay. I forgot how hard it is to see stone in this stupid game sometimes. Stupid's a bit of a stretch. Is that really how you treat your favorite game, Chris? Uh, did you have all of your gear upgraded? W yes, I think I did have, uh, not like fully upgraded, but really close. I think the complication, um, with defeating the Valkyrie easily, because I'll be honest, all of the other nine Valkyrie that I fought, um, came pretty easy. Except the last one. It was just the very last one. And I was on stream, so everybody was watching. And, you know, I had to like, I had to like, uh, zhuzh it up a bit. Because it's not good content to just beat it the first try, you know what I'm saying? This is one thing the base, gonna make it ugly. I'm gonna do everything on the boat. Everything's gonna be done on the boat. We're all gonna live happily on the boat. We're going to name the boat. Let's 
gonna be the boat. I like the way you think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's totally that was totally the reason. <laughs> and nothing to do with my incompetence. <laughs> no. No shot. All right, sorry. I know I'm no, I know I'm lollygagging here a little bit, but there you go. Look, build piece, steering wheel, rope ladder, dirt floor, cultivatable. Ugh. I did not mean to pull that out, but we're getting out over by the water, and we're gonna make make our raft. Everything we're about to do is raft focused. Watch us build our raft and it's like in a cove. I just can't see it because the map is, isn't big enough yet. Uh, let me see. Yeah, another game was easy. Yeah. Know that their easy dumb game was easy and dumb. So much easier to bust down these bunk ass little trees than big trees. All right, let's throw down. What? Oh. I don't mean nothing to build. Oh, I clicked the wrong thing, I see. Oh, dude, seriously. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. We'll make this quick and dirty. A flint axe. Clearing the brush makes it easier you. to run around. You. Hold on. Uh, run around and see de danger incoming. So I knocked down all the little stuff too. Yeah, fair enough. Hi, I would like to offer a promotion to your channel's viewers, followers, views, chatbots. Prices lower than any competitor. Nice. Uh, quality guaranteed to be the best. Uh, audio on incredibly flexible and convenient order management panel. Everything is in your hands. Turn it on and off and customize. Go to doghype.com. Uh, are we seeing what we think we're seeing? Is that? No. everybody welcome to another lovely episode of bot or not so a one la flare 200 vch has offered us promotion to our channel 
Check it out, guys. Viewers, followers, views, chatbots. The price is lower than than any other competitor. Well, A1, I would uh, just want to throw this out there after, at, for you. The lowest price would be free. Go right ahead and do that for for re 90 free for me. Thank you very much. But let's go ahead and look into little old A1. Let's pull up their chat. Totally legit chatter. Yep, that's what it looks like. Ooh, the account was created January 22nd, 2022, and they've been following since three minutes ago. And I don't even remember getting a notification for the follow. Did it go off? I don't think I saw that. <laughs> Bad streamer moment. Negative, Ghost Rider. <laughs> All right, so if we go to their channel and we click their about, there's not much. It says we don't know much about them, but we are sure A1 LaFlair 200 VCH is great. <sighs> Doubt. How about we check out any stream history? Hop over the Sully Gnome. Pulls up nothing. Well, I think we have somewhat of a clear answer so far, but let's just uh, let's just check. Let's sit, let's check with you guys. You guys tell me if, based on the information, this is a bot or it's not. Uh, where's the poll overlay? Bot or not? Start the poll. And there it is right there. Press one in chat if you think it's a bot. Press two in chat if you think it is not a bot. If it's not a bot, they get to live in infamy on our channel to hang out with us on a regular basis. But if it is a bot, then they get banned immediately. Three. <laughs> Thanks, Deluxe. <laughs> I choose chaos. That's what Deluxe says. <laughs> Leave it up for a full minute at least. Ah, oh, silly vote thing always counts. Abby and I is the same. Yeah, that's funny. Probably because you guys are in the same. Uh, Something. I don't know. That's weird. All right. That's active one minute. Finish the poll. Ooh. They're a bot. Well, A1. Ah, let me make that go away. Go away. Shit. I, I swear I know what I'm doing. Finish. Hide poll from overlay. There we go. <laughs> A1, nice to meet you, bud. Thank you very much for uh, coming by and stopping by hanging out with the channel. But unfortunately, we have determined that you are a bot with our perfectly good scanning abilities and our bot detection services. No captures here. You didn't have to click a bunch of pictures of uh, fire hydrants for us to figure it out. We were able to snuff you out as a bot. Be gone. Oof. All right, homies, let's get back to some Valheim at Raft. <laughs> All right, that was fun. I haven't done that in a while. Fire hydrants, bridges, yeah. Uh, apples on trees. The list goes on and on. We'll put this one here and this down here. Crosswalks, traffic lights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was my first episode of Butter Not. That was great. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I work really hard on those Essipodes. 
Oh, uh, we're a little far from the, uh... We'll do it right... There. Oh, okay. Already this is gonna be harder than I thought. Just a ladder? On what though? Oh. A working ladder. Oh, we need more wood. We're gonna have to stockpile wood like in the beginning, right? Yeah, the music's from uh, old Sims game, right? It's like the Sims uh, loading room or whatever. Also, hello, sucks or uh, sorry, uh, Evo Dave. How you doing today, bud? Oh, sneaky, sneaky. I could use a deer. Look at here, how are you? Doing pretty good, homie. I've been playing a lot of WoW randomly. Nice, dude. What? Two for one. Things never go that well around here. Yeah, I've been playing a lot of World of Warcraft lately for... for one reason. I, I haven't even pl started playing the game. You monster. <laughs> well, they needed to go. We also don't have a lot of food, but the sooner we get out on the raft, the better, I say. So steering wheel, sail. Whoa, okay, whoa. Deer hide six, okay. <laughs> I got I got the ladder back. <laughs> it looks great. <laughs> oh, dude, that's so funny. Whew. Okay, so this works just like use the rudder so we can still use the rudder or no? Oh, interesting. So we still need to build the sail. We need a couple more deer hide. And we have two. Ooh, sneaky. We should probably get a bow going. Oh, you press spacebar to unanchor. Oh, wait, does that mean we are anchored? Oh, it is on like rudder mode. Oh, weird. Look at his little arms. That's so funny. Oh, you know what I'm happy about? That it moves pretty good. Oh, dude, this is definitely interesting. All right, first and foremost, we need to start building like, uh... oh, our workbench and everything has to be on here. All right, let's go back. Yeah, it's given us like a small amount of, uh... Let's 
going on here? How do I know if I'm rudded or not? Oh, I'm just pushing forward. Oh, I see. Oh, dude, this is already really cool. Let's put um, a little bit of effort into the raft. All right, what are we naming our uh, what are we naming our boat, boys, boys and girls? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Smugs, water bug, huh? Water smug. Ooh, ooh, oh, something the water buffalo, something type of thing. Come on now. Oh, interesting. You'd have to like get around somehow. It is a, the snapping's a little strange. That's interesting. And it's like expanding or something. Is it, f is it floating more? Come on. easier yeah but who wants to do any of that console command stuff why are we so crooked now <laughs> I don't understand Work with me. All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to 
jump on this raft and we're gonna build our thing on the raft. Is Captain Wheel in the game? But yes, hi, hello. <laughs> How you doing today, cat? We have a uh, um we're playing a modded version of the game and it comes with it's called Valheim Raft. Essentially, it is the game Valheim, but with a raft option. So it's kind of plays like the game raft. Welcome to the channel. All right, so let's figure this out. We still need a bunch of deer hide. Turn. Turn better. Turn way less slow. Come on. What what is happening here? Should we totally add it to the game? Yes, I'd be down for that. I kind of agree. This it it's cool in concept, but right now I'm stuck. So right now I hate it. At this current moment, I hate it. It's the worst. It's the worst mod I've ever played in my life. There we go. Rudder. Come on. Come on. All right, all right. We're just trying to, we're just literally trying to move right now. I don't understand. We have no wind. I don't know why I did that. I think I did. I think I botched it already. And I'm not even really sure what's wrong. I'm stuck on that. That can't be it. There's no, I'm not fucking touching it. Wait, where'd my crazy ladder go? I, I still don't have a... Oh, there it is. It was moving so well before. It's, it's getting there. I know the rock is right in front of us. I I get that, but that can't be it. I mean, I know it is the, it, it is the reason. I get it, but I I refuse to let the rock adjust uh, uh, adjust my reality. Okay, the rock tried. He tried to adjust all of our realities uh, uh, with with Black Adam and telling us that it was doing really well, but it was not doing really well. I didn't believe him. You didn't either. And I'm not going to let the rock stop this raft. Not on my watch. Oh, oh, oh. Are we cooking with gas? Nice. We are not parking by rocks ever again. Yes. Ah, okay. All right, let's just go across the water. Let's just see where we can go.
We need a little bit more wood and um I think that's about it. Yeah, we're fucking we're we're off. We need light. Wow, our raft is looking so good. <laughs> Trying to make sure we pick a good spot to stop. Oh, well, there's a... Whoa! Okay, it's just it's a little glitchy, it's all. Anchored. The section needs a re <gasps> Oh no, we're not there yet. Whoa, look how dope that is. Holy shit. That's way cooler than I thought it was gonna be. So right now, currently, we can't put... Four. That stuff here, but we could, if we were smart, put like this down and maybe then we could place it on top. Can we do any of the torches right now? We don't even have other. Oh, we do. We do. Okay. Hold on. Alright, that'll give us kind of a starting point. We're gonna need a bed, we're gonna need to build an actual raft here. Currently what I have is kind of a platform thing, so, you know, we need something better than this for shins. Uh, and... We're gonna use this stuff to do it. So... Let's finish up the squareness. The rectangularness of it all. Dang, like you have to like get kind of creative when you're trying to build with this. Interesting. Nice wide back end. And we'll do a pointed front end. We might try to make ourselves like a sailboat, right? How cool would that be? the build mechanics all um, goofed or whatever like they uh, they work differently furniture wouldn't it be cool to build a stone castle boat all right I'm super into this this is actually really cool stone castle raft oh wrong one Because you're in the water and it's moving. Yeah, 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 I got it. I got it.
Ooh, we're out of wood. All right, hold on. Let's do it that way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, I thought I was supposed to grab all my resources from out in the water, like raft. Gather some cooked food soon. Ooh, this was the right decision so far. So we're going to use like roof pieces. That's my plan at least. Some somehow use roof pieces. Yeah, like that. I don't know if that's where we actually want the back of our ship to be, so we'll figure it we'll figure it out as we go. Well, let's repair everything. Let's get a little makeshift roof over this. Every time I land, this guy's gonna be like, yo. are you on about? Actually, I know exactly what the problem is. No shot. It's got to be closed off on all sides. If we can, we can get cooking. It does feel safe, at least. Just the option of being out on the water.
Jeez, imagine trying to cultivate like the what boars or wolves all on the ship. Nice, thank you for the neck tail. Yeah, the sea serpent. Yeah. Kind of why it's important to get a sail going before we get too far into it. We can at least get away. Nice job. Slap in the bush. We'll build a bow and arrow real fast and uh, start collecting arrows from old beat up buildings and then we'll take on Elk, elk Fear. I think it's what it's called. Because that'll give us a nice bump. And then it'll be so nice to be right next to Copper. Oh. I gotta remember the deer are one of my goals right now. Alright, let's try to put dirt on the uh, on the base and put a uh, campfire on the base. Good try at least. Invalid placement, okay. Piece of ground that can be placed on rafts. A few more food recipes involves honey. Now I struggle with getting enough honey. That's funny. Oh, dirt floor one by one. It's it's weird where it wants to stay. That's interesting. What? You still can't place on top of that? Oh, what do they expect you to do about fire? Wait a second. That's actually bad. I misunderstood. So the mod that you guys added is necessary. How are you supposed to keep yourself warm? If you can't build a fire on the raft. I thought this was a, like a catch all for that, like a, you know. What the God in hell? All right, all right, all right. Then, uh. It's compatible. Yeah, it's. That's cool. That's just, just interesting overall that that's uh, what they would do there. I would think that that would be something they would, you know, add to add to it or whatever. So what? Uh, do you know what the mod is called by any chance to look? Place anywhere. OK. Placement unlocked. Precise placement? Probably placement unlocked. Wow. 
vortex. Ah. Slow download. Here, I'm gonna use the restroom real fast anyway, because I got a Wii. Go ahead and close that. All installed. Deploy mods. All right, I'm going to use the restroom real fast, homies. Thank you guys, as always, for hanging out. I will be right back. Enjoy some SPTV. Because by the time you get to the house, it's got to be dark. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> 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 now I'm, I'm mounting him. Get out of the way! Please get out of the way! <laughs> my anchor's caught on him. Oh, I lost all my stuff! <laughs> What's happening? No, 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 no! Oh, God. Alright, 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 alright. <laughs> Why is the anchor? Restore the crane. There we go. There we go. No, no, no. What's happening? Uh, all for nothing. It looks like Jesus. I'm supposed to open some geodes, bud. Oh, I just fucking threw them away! Uh, Alright then, moving on. <laughs> What? <laughs> no, it's so bad now. Oh no! <laughs> no. This one, and then hold on, and all of that should break. Okay, I'm really excited right now. <laughs> Watch us not slide even a little. Oh, oh here he goes! Wait, what is that? Ah! Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> Holy crap! That, that did work really well. I, I forgot to clear the track. <laughs> okay. GF. No! <laughs> LOL! Why is the voice so... <laughs> I what bitch. the fuck? Oh, it's personality. So you guys get different pitches, I think. Of the same voice? Sounds like Luigi LOL. <laughs> I am a fucking robot. <laughs> this is how Darkstar sounds. <laughs> <laughs> you I fucking love this so oh my god. Holy fuck. Okay. Yeah, this is a good question uh on Hex. Am I just discovering uh, okay. this? I need some way to uh to like fade that out. Which one was a perfect clip? I missed it. All right, let's hop back in. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, that is a perfect clip, that's true. All those boat Boat jumps did really well. 
It was like it was like jackass for streaming or something like that. Video game jackass. All right, now show me something good. Hell yeah, brother. Let's see, Captain's Quarters will be back here. Probably back into places, but we'll have to figure it out as we go. Oh. Just a small little ship. Let's put this on the where to go there it is what's going on here is the purple side the side i climb on or something we'll put the other one over here once we're ready we can even have like a lower end storage. It's kind of interesting idea. We need to get deer hide ASAP. This is risky. Ah! Oh, I thought I was gonna hit the raft. I got pretty close, actually. Damn! Get a man.
That would be nice too. You could pull up next to other structures if they're close enough to the coast and basically get them uh get them in the little in the radius and then you can break them down pretty quickly and easily. Just some lower storage I'll probably never use, but I got it just in case I need it. Put that right there for now. This is going to be interesting. Do this. It's like section needs a roof or something like that it'll give me. Let's see if this works. Trying to go super minimal here. Nice. All right, we'll adjust that later. Oh shit. Oh, good thing I got coal now. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Not what I wanted at all. Let's put yeah, a wall here. Hmm. What's the best course of action? That'll take up a lot more space. Let's do it that way for now. And then up here we'll put our little whatever. Okay, okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. We're cooking with gas. Can we make a, we can't, all right, we need more. Don't you dare come attack on my ship. All right, let's break down some more wood. This is kind of a precarious little spot.
It's getting there. Yeah, it sure is. We'll have to do some deer hunting here soon. Oh, hello. That was almost the end. Shoot. The fucking climbing is so bad. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it was all doing so well until then. <laughs> Whew. All right. Oh, I keep I keep burning meat. see here actually yeah not not the best option we're gonna need these for here yep Let's, um, hmm. Hold on. That's right. A lot of wood to build a boat, huh? Oh, I've got a whole thing right there. That's awesome. hear them oh okay oh a whole party's getting started hello i'm watching a car park waiting i'm watching in a car park waiting my prescriptions like an old fart but hey 4g baby <laughs> just happened here why is this all 
coming up out of nowhere. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, dude. I I don't have a bed. <laughs> oh, no. I was just feeding myself, too, dude. What the fuck? All right. Let's hope that this connects right over here. That's what we're going to hope. Yeah, I get it. You die. Things are bad when you die. Don't die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, I don't get more than two bars, 3G, so it's like life of luxury over here. Yeah, I'd be moving to the fucking pharmacy if I were you. Or wherever you're waiting, your prescriptions. Yeah, I'd be I'd be living there. I'm like, oh, I've always wanted to be a pharmacist. <laughs> They're good, homie. We're trying this uh, this mod out. It's definitely really fun. There's a there's a lot going on here. Um But it's going to be really fun to see like where this goes. Like what what you do from here. So for some berries or something, dude. Dude, I think we got lucky. My uh, World of Warcraft run is going well. It's just taking way longer than I thought it was gonna. Tone when you speak? Is there? Is there a, uh, is there an audio issue? <laughs> I should try to, I should try to get high pitch when I talk <laughs> just to mess with you. <laughs> There's an audio issue. <laughs> uh, nobody's mentioned anything so far. Is there, is there, is there any audio issues on your, anyone else's end? feedback interesting I'm not seeing anything on my end I don't really hear anything either gosh I hope not We'll have to see what Deluxe says. Nothing else on. Nothing's different than before. Well, audio is all the same. <laughs> that still looks ridiculous. dry off here just a moment and we can uh, look into some audio issues
Let's leave that. Hell yeah, this is starting to look so good. Honestly, wow. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay. How much more wood do we have? Five pieces. Okay. Let me, uh, mess around with this real fast. One second. Hello. Interesting, why can't I hear that? Ah, weird, okay. How about now? Huh? Yeah? I'm not hearing any, uh, high pitched, high pitches, high pitches, bitches. Yeah. I don't know, man. Troubleshoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll probably be easier. Fair enough. I still hear it though. Interesting. by another bunch of uh, gray dwarves here. Let's move the boat over this way. just do we'll just go straight in we'll stop right about from that. A 
We'll get a sail out in front of us. This place will be looking like a boat in no time. God damn, it gets, it's like super sensitive how wide it is or wide it isn't. I don't know. It's a pr pretty rudimentary little boat. <laughs> God damn. Whoa, I've never seen that before. Alright, well, never mind. You win, dear, you win. Ooh, mushroom. Interesting. I just figured out what I can do to see. I totally spaced on that. Oh, weird. Okay. I, now I hear what you're talking about, like a high pitch. I think I just got rid of it. Strange. I did know what that was. That's crazy. Well, that sucks.
Come on. Give me all the juice. And by juice, I mean wood. I do still hear it, but it's not too noticeable. Maybe background noise getting picked up somehow. It's got to be this little plug in here. I, I've kind of always had issue with it. It's crazy that you're noticing it like harder now. Maybe you have headphones on or something differently. Interesting. I'm trying to think what I can do to mitigate. Oh, we're finally full of items, huh? Okay. Interesting. It's interesting overall how this thing works. Working on it, we have a fair amount of wood left. Let's see if we can't get the rest of our underbelly done. If it would even reach. Yeah. This part would be almost impossible to do right. So close. All right, we'll just have to live with that. It's not too bad looking, actually. Here, let's get on the boat and do it from the boat. Pull it to the side. Hey, Deluxe, were you hearing any like high pitched 
uh, a high pitched noise while I'm talking. It effectively disappears when I'm not talking. anything else stream huh okay god damn it could be something I can't hear fair enough So funny. The the boat stuff is still funny. Okay. Let's turn this around. a piece of wood way out here something fall off the boat almost done Damn, a little closer next time, huh? Shit. moving the fucking ship all right I think I think we're officially cooking with gas right now this works pretty good I think we are currently smoking out our base but we'll figure that out in just a second Yep, uh, that doesn't look good.
Oof, okay, ah. It's giving me a hard time here. All right, that's better, okay. It needs a roof. Oh, shucks. Okay, all right, hold on. Check it out. We have a, we, you know, we got, we got a little boat here. We got a little, like a little tiny boat type of thing. Looks like a little, t a little boat. A little, you know, a little rafty, rafting type, type of raft type of thing. Not so bad. Got some space for storage. It's got a point on it. Looks kind of like a boat. You know, it's, it's, it's use some work. It's a little hard to navigate. Uh, it's not gonna fit in every every little spot. It gets stuck on everything. But you know, we got something. to find somewhere where there is Ooh. Okay. It's kind of freaky. Just a little bit of flat land. We can do some uh deer hunting so we can get a proper sail going. Okay. All right. It's a little glitchy every now and again. Oh, no shot. I am in a cove. Oh no shot, dude. Hold on. Hold the fucking phone. Did we really build ourselves in a cove? I made a jo I was a joke. I was just joking. There's land all around us. This better be big enough for the boat, man. That is so... I couldn't have planned that if I tried, dude. Please no. Oh my god. Does that look wide enough? I'm gonna have to scope it out first. I don't want to. I don't want to get the boat all in there and then I can't get it out. Motherfucker, dude. You're kidding me. There's a lot of things to hit underneath the water here. What's Parker right here? And go scope this uh, little spot out. Oh, 
Oh no. Spent all that time building this amazing boat. Okay, it looks pretty wide actually. Ooh, looks like it gets kind of tight over here. We're, I'm assuming too that this leads out to the ocean. Oh, that's pretty tight. Oh. Far it looks okay ish. Oh, this, this part gets a lot tighter, tighter up here. Ooh. Okay. Oh no, I don't know, man. Oh, fuck. Oh, dude, that is the worst. Yeah, there's no shot I get past that. Okay, we're going to have to check another of uh, the other sides because. <laughs> oh, my God. That's such bullshit. Let's head back. It's like almost a straight shot, almost good until the very end, which maybe with a pickaxe we could get through to be fair. Of course, we gotta have a pickaxe first. By the way, I got four hours of sleep last night. So the Cole Terran race unlock has all these achievements that are necessary for the race unlock. Uh, and every time I completed an achievement, another one would like pop up or I would realize that it wasn't just this. It was actually this and this or sorry, some achievements required other achievements to be unlocked first. And that that was a big blow. man. I had I had a like at a, a point I had it looking like it was about four hours away. And then the rest of the weekend happened. All right, so. Let's see here. We're going to check perimeter. Fuck off. Yeah, we're going to check perimeter first just to be totally sure. But it's not looking great. I am almost 100% sure we're screwed. Which is just so classic smug. Truly, that could not have been more perfect more perfect of an awful thing. Had I made the boat more narrow, 
we might be able to get through this. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. There's quite a bit of open ocean here. Doesn't mean the run is dead. It just means this boat is dead to us. <laughs> Okay, we got a quite a bit of an opening over here and somewhat of an opening over here too, okay. That's all closed off too, dude. <sighs> oh. <laughs> the trees loaded in, basically denoting the wall that I'd have to get through. All right, let's try. <laughs> oh no, dude. We're so stuck. Oh, fuck. All right, there's a big mountain over here. The mountains, lake boat for the win. Yeah, yeah. Man. Lake boat. You're killing me. I gotta be honest. That's like the worst possible outcome. Okay, this looks a little wider. Oh. By a little, I mean like literally a little. There's a lot of stuff in the way. It's not so bad. Actually, the damage sounds like it's happening to the stone. Where is the stone? What the is the stone? Oh, 
Oh, hey, bud. No, 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 no. We're leaving. We're just leaving. We're leaving. We're leaving. Yeah, no, no. We're all good. Yep. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Bye. Nice to meet you. Bye. Just kidding. Just, just making our way out of here. This is a wrong turn. Wrong neighborhood. Wrong neighborhood. Wrong neighborhood. We gotta turn around. We gotta turn around. I can't. I can't navigate like this. Wrong neighborhood. Wrong neighborhood. Wrong neighborhood. Ah! The fuck? Assholes! No, 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 come on. Oh! Oh god! <laughs> this is getting re <laughs> really hairy. Oh no! More. Oh, no, dude, no. Oh, my God, this is really bad. <laughs> that rock was coming from me. Ye who throw the first stone. Hey, Darkstar. Yeah, Deluxe is saying that he's not hearing any kind of uh, ringing or anything like that. And we just found out that we built our entire ship inside of a basically a cove. And there's no obvious way out. That's true, that's true. Yeah, like when I'm talking, uh, is there a uh, like high pitched noise in the background of my, uh, I guess of my verbal audio? Interesting, the things that are breaking are not the boat. It's my young boy ears. I'm not insane. Well, I, I did hear it before, and I changed one thing, and I lowered it quite a bit. Um, and I think I know what it is. I've got feedback coming through a speaker. No noise that I hear. Fair enough, fair enough. Well, fug. We're going to have to go the other way. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to try this out. We'll see what's over here, but I think we're screwed over here too. Ooh. We'll just say dark stars and say nothing I can hear over. Oh, okay, fair enough. Tinnitus. Wait, so wait. Is it you're still hearing it, Dark Star, or no? Ta da! Yes, I am. Huh. Here, let me play it on my end. Hello, hello, hello. Crazy. I don't I don't hear it at all now. Shit. 
I don't know. I have volume cranked here. I here. If I do that, you should be able to hear it a lot better. Yeah, I heard it there. Hey, yo, what's going on with all this fog? Oh, rude, dude. I just hear an echo. Yeah, I'm I'm turning the I'm turning it on on my end so I can hear the stream. I heard a secondary smug. I'm not crazy. I don't think you are crazy. What the fuck? No, 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 no. Hey, 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 hey. All good. No, you're good back there, bud. You don't gotta come. You don't gotta come this close. We're going for it. We're gonna go for the. We're gonna go for the river. Cause I don't think he can come to to the river. I think he's given up on us. Whew. Ah ah ah! Looking at my phone. All right, here we go. Here we go. So a lot of this should be fine. Oh, fuck. Immediately. We hit something immediately. Interesting. So the boat doesn't get damaged, bro. All right, I can work with this. I can work with this. Just straight down the river, huh? It's all good. We got this. It is funny that that little bit of ocean quantified enough. stuck on okay 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 oh no come on snow runner has trained me for this I'm using all of my abilities and skills earned as a streamer over the past couple years All you gotta do is turn a wheel a little bit. Shake yourself loose. 
Oh my god, rock was coming from my head. Whoa, no shot. Did we just drop some uh, copper? Is that copper? That's copper right there, huh? Hold on. Grab that real fast. Got some copper. Oh, ow. Climb! 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 Oh, okay. This is getting bad. It's all good. fine it's gonna be fine they're in the water they can't damage me in the water all they can do is swim yeah they're weaklings in the water yes this is where we're probably screwed i'm hoping the boat can cause enough damage to the rocks Oof. To get us loose. There you go. There you go. Yeah, well met. Yeah, thanks. Here. We got this. Stone's gonna break any minute now. That epic journey music, yeah. We must break free. The forest tries to bring us down. Getting just a little bit more damage. There we go. We'll run him over. Ooh. Ooh, we did it. I broke through! <laughs> uh oh shit, uh oh, uh, hey oh, hey oh. Come on. Don't be beached now! Come on! I got more, I got more copper! Somehow the copper's in the boat! Yes, dude. Ah, fuck. Okay. We're almost there. We're almost there. One more. One more push. Crash. Free from the shackles of the Black Forest. Whew. The 
open ocean is now ours. <sighs> okay, fuck. <laughs> I'm to leave. I don't know where that means to go. Oh, he's a lot faster this time around. What do, where 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 do I go? Where do I go? Just in case. I think we made it. Yes, tear down ODST. All right. Whew. Look at that. That's pretty dope. That was that was a bit of a high note, bit of a scary high note. Oh, I'm glad we made it out of there. So we're 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 in the ocean at least. We still don't have um, a solid grasp of our base here. I think it's important for us to try to keep it reasonably sized and then I think on the side of it somewhere we should build a smaller boat like a dock a docking station type thing <laughs> thank you thank you for, for, for that so I appreciate that but. oh all right well I'll be honest Here, let me go and do a quick check Because I do know we have some jobs today. Somebody said, hey, how's it going to me? That's a fake number. Okay. So something just happened in the uh, Oklahoma City area. I think for everywhere too, you guys can maybe speak to some of this if you know anything about real estate or any of that kind of stuff. Um, recently, I like when I get calls from my own number. Yeah, that's funny. GG scammers, yeah. <laughs> so recently, um, they lifted the how do I say this? It's like a, uh, uh, oh gosh, what's it called? Give me a second. I have it in the back of my mind. It's a, uh, like the, the, the no rent policy, I guess that was like, uh, government like issued or whatever was recently lifted thus like people who were totally used to how it was suddenly didn't have uh, how it was, how it's been for like the past four or five years or whatever or sorry three or four years or whatever suddenly didn't have like the capacity to pay the rent therefore a lot of people got evicted like something like seventy thousand is some article, I don't know the validity of this, something like 70,000 children just here in Oklahoma are now um, homeless, which is like, I don't know what that means. I have no idea. So so there's two sides to this coin, right? Like a lot of people are, are out of locations that they were in and other people are um, raising the rent in certain places. Uh, others are, um, they're like, out on the streets and so now they're willing to like like rent anywhere um 
I don't know. So it's kind of this weird dynamic and it's a weird position for me personally to be in because that's kind of part of my job. And, and I don't know if it's like, like it's a little slow all of a sudden, like literally last week was really slow. The week before that, I had like 14 jobs throughout the week, a bunch of stuff coming in. Last week, I had a total of... Here, let me see if I can pull it up real fast just to give you guys an idea. Calendar. So week before that, I had like 15 jobs. And then last week, I had uh, five. <laughs> and the week before that, I had... Uh, uh, a, like 10. 10 the week before that. So So... Five is pretty low. Five is kind of like one of my first weeks. I haven't had a five week since, yeah, since kind of the beginning. Um, nothing against that. I'm fine. Just to, just so that you guys are aware. Um, but I'm wondering to what degree has it affected what the property managers are even focusing on right now. There's no shortage of work. Like I'll always still have work to do, but. I think their priorities are very uh, moved around right now. And property management companies in general, just they just don't seem to like renters and vice versa, right? They're just the land. No renters ever liked a landlord. And uh, no landlord, no landlord has ever liked a renter. So yeah, strange overall. Uh, strange position to be in thing to be paying attention to I'm not really sure um, you know how I should feel about it but uh, I don't know we'll we'll see how it we'll see how it all unfolds I'm interested to see if that how that goes maybe it'll drive interest rates down and I can refinance my place speaking of renters slash homeowners yeah yeah fair enough that's a good point I think overall like a couple places i i just recently was dealing with uh helping a guy with a, a door at his property and the guy itself said uh that the rent had gone up it was four something and now it was six something and uh which is a 50 percent increase which is crazy a 50 percent increase is crazy even though we're talking 400 to 600 dollars, that may not sound like a lot a 50% increase is a lot. That's crazy. That's super crazy. Anglosphere and fucking over first time buyers. Never heard of that one before. Yeah. We have to vote for levies here, which is a tax applied to property to pay for things like medical response, schools, community hospitals, etc. Homeowners are pissed and have been for years that renters can vote on that. Interesting. Like there's no like prerequisite to voting for that particular thing. Interesting. Yeah. Really non landowners can vote to increase property taxes. Yeah, I get it. And that's that, that part of stuff. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm very, uh, very unaware of how all that stuff works by any means. So, um, it's just an interesting kind of dynamic. I uh, I'm learning currently with being a handyman, um, the ebb and flow of working with property management companies, where their priorities lie, kind of what they want me to do, weird little like expectations that they have on you to just kind of like, just like, hey, just figure it out. Yeah, yeah I don't care how many band-aids you need, just figure it out. And I'm kind of, back and forth on like how comfortable I am with decisions like that. Of course, it's normally property managers, huge rental agencies that are, are maddest. Oh, for sure. So that's another thing too. I just did a little research, but it seems like property managers, property management companies generally only take about, um, 25% or no 10%, sorry, 10% of the rent. So if it's a thousand dollars, you still get your 900, let's say, and uh, they get they get a hundred, um, which a one to one. That doesn't sound great, but it is not one to one. It's you have maybe five properties total and they have like 400 
or thou or a thousand or a couple thousand um so those numbers add up a lot and not everybody has problems all the time so it's kind of like it's kind of like insurance i don't know if you guys have ever looked into this uh working as an insurance adjuster um and i it may be some this is really common shit for regular people but i was i was never really um paying attention to much more than video games <laughs> so uh yeah in insurance they charge these premiums for whatever the cost of the insurance is um and then like 90 percent of the time nothing happens like there's there are times where we've had guys who've been giving money to the insurance company for over 30 years and they have like one lapse in payment and that's when they happen to get in the wreck or a random wreck they were rear-ended or whatever and we won't afford them coverage which is crazy to me because yeah sure right now they can't they, they didn't pay or whatever but they've been paying for 30 years with no accidents no history of accidents like this is the first time in, I don't know it's kind of crazy have you worked for a property manager company as a janitor for a while taking care of properties a mall oh that's kind of fucking cool actually yeah I've, I've been wanting to get into like the headspace of the property management companies to kind of understand what are their uh, uh, expectations are speaking of jobs that like I really liked aside from this one I think this is probably in, in the running right now for one of my favorite jobs of all time being a handyman is a lot of fun to be honest um, but uh, probably before that or, or still currently my favorite job I've ever had of all time is being a valet valet being a valet was a lot of fun if I had properties I would hire a property manager I think that's the route that I'm going to be going eventually is that I'll be my own property manager. I mean, there's a point in which I can, uh, how do I say this? I can build up enough rapport with enough of these other handyman type dudes and start to have my own lex lexicon, right? My own Rolodex. There you go. No, it's lexicon. Rolodex. No, yeah, that's Rolodex. Singing Rolex for some reason. Uh, Rolodex of like contact info, and then I can just do that stuff myself. They have contractors, with contractors, and presents out there for rentals already. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Barney's a premier first person roguelike RPG with cooperative play, cryptic items, brutal traps, and these monsters. Oh, is this like an MMO or no? It's it's just co op. Huh. Wow, that's my list. I've never heard of it. Looks like a lot of fun. It's funny, as a matter of fact. So yeah, I I thought I'd give you guys a little quick little zhuzh of an update. I'm not um uh sure what, what we're gonna be doing next stream. I'll probably go back to World of Warcraft. I'm gonna try to play a little bit of a wow um tonight and tomorrow to kind of maybe i can get through all these missions i think i have like i think i honestly have four more missions to go here i'll show you guys just so annoying Ooh, ooh. we'll let this load up my account information is being slow. Rude. I know you guys really care about my WoW progress. <laughs> this is big for me because I just never did this. I never jumped into WoW uh, like this. I still actually, to be fair, don't feel like I've jumped into WoW yet at all. Dragon Isle. Okay. All right. So if I go to achievements and I scroll up the achievements that I needed to um, be this race 
to play the game as this race were uh, initially it said like Pride of Colteris and uh, like Lore Master of Colteris. There you go. Yeah, yeah. There's and so in in Lore Master of Colteris, you have to complete a sound plan, which was like. Eight different quest storylines, which each one of those quest storylines has about 10 to 15 quests in it. Um, Storm Song and Dance. This right here, this Lore Master of Colteris, took me about 24 hours just to complete. That's so depressing. Um, but it, it, I got these three, these three with it, and then there's some. This is just the introduction. And then now that you have this, then you have to do the Pride of Colteris and a Nation United. Yeah, sorry. A Nation United, which is the Pride of Colteris and Lore, Lore Master of Colteris, which those took about four to eight hours a piece. So or another half a day or whatever. There's probably somewhere I can look at like how long I've played or whatever. Wealth, kills, legacy, quests, quests abandon. Okay. Quests completed. Four hundred and seventy-three quests. This has all been for Colteris. I'm not even there yet. Kills character slots, consumables. Is there no like time? time played or something like that total gold acquired proving grounds dungeons and raids social travel skills quests total deaths <laughs> and then so after after all of this I now need uh, this one called Tides of Vengeance, which each one of these has about four to, I mean, not four, sorry, uh, 10 to 15 missions a piece. And then, and then before that, so I thought I was like, oh, okay, so it's just these four sets, about 40 missions or so left, right? Then I realized to start the Tides of Vengeance, you have to complete ready for war. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, that's why I'm tired. That's why I'm tired today. Because I've been putting all my effort into this. All of this. Now, I know you don't play WoW, or a lot of you guys don't. But I'm going to show you exactly why I'm doing this. So when you create a character in WoW, when you're brand new to WoW, you have the Alliance and the Horde. And then you have the Allied Races. Now these Allied Races are like versions of the Alliance and Horde characters. <clears throat> but they're slightly different. So here's a Tauren, right? That's a Horde character. As a... Uh, an allied uh, an allied race of the Tauren is the High Mountain Tauren and it's a moose so this is like a cow or a bull and this one's a moose so it's just a slight difference some of them are just totally different altogether I would never pick this I'll never unlock this I don't care to um, but some of them are like the uh, like it's an Aztec it's like an Aztec troll and it stands up tall or whatever versus their troll which is kind of always always hunched over just stuff like this is kind of cool that they have these other races here they're like modified versions of the other ones they also um in turn look a little better and have a better like design to them one of the allied races that i really wanted to play uh was specifically this one Coltiran. The Coltiran are like a pirate, like water type race or whatever. But the the core 
important part here, of course, is the fact that they are chunky boys. Big old fatties. And I'm just going to show this off. This is why I'm working so hard. Face doesn't matter, hairstyle, color. Uh, this one. I mean, guys. Huh? Come on. Look at that. It's perfect, dude. I can't wait to be playing with this character. And specifically, I'm going to be a drunken master. <laughs> that practically looks just like me. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. This is all of this is so that I can play the game officially the first time by myself without uh, someone kiting me along too much. And I'm going to play as a Kung Fu master dick boy with a with a with a man bun and well, with a balding man bun, much like I have It'll look just like me, except for, you know, he looks way tougher than I do. Maybe I should go with black. Uh, black's too... Yeah, brown's gonna be great. Alright, guys. That's our show. Homies, as always, thank you very much for hanging out with me today. Um, appreciate it. That balding thing. Yeah, yeah, I mean, come on. We're, I mean, it's like, it's like perfect. It's like perfect. So yeah, I'll, I'll be back Wednesday. Maybe we'll play some WoW. I don't know. As always, let's put this out. Spotify. homies thanks for hanging out in the room with me today on the desk of course is our still is our wow stuff and my free games folder which i won't forget about you guys will probably enjoy that someday we still have a couple things up on the shelf sometimes even i might be up on the shelf is it, can i do the voice thing from here Shelf. Maybe once we're done playing WoW, well, we'll uh, get this added to the shelf and we'll just put it up here and we'll never play it again. But for now, it's going to be down there on the desk. So I, uh, as always, appreciate you guys for hanging out. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the, welcome to the office. And I'll see you guys on Monday. Wednesday. Wednesday. It is Monday. I'll see you guys in the future. Which will be Wednesday. Peace. <laughs> How's that helium voice coming in, huh? <laughs> I don't even know if it works. Did, did I sound like helium? Did that work? It worked? Oh, okay. All right. Uh oh, it's loading there. Thanks, little smug. <laughs> Well, I, I, I guess my outro broke. All right, well, see you guys.